Okay, let's talk about dangerous right now. This is a blind corner. You can't see what's to the left. If you come out and not pay attention, you will definitely get broadsided. So this is called showing the car. And I'm going up slow, looking, going slow. And then I'm going to make a right turn out. That left over there is a little bit more challenging. So I'm just gonna take my time. You gotta be careful. Another busy, dangerous area is parking lots. So let's go ahead and talk about this. A lot of accidents happen in parking lots. I'm using my right turn signal. I'm looking, I'm checking, and I'm proceeding going around. Always looking for people coming out, people not paying attention, and I'm going to be aware. You don't wanna cut through the parking spots because that's dangerous too. There's another person walking, look for feet on the other side of the vehicle. You always have to look and literally gotta get into a searching pattern. And then I'm turning gently, always looking, always checking. And then I have to go to the right side of the road. You can't make a left turn here. I see a lot of people doing that. Be that good role model. I'm gonna turn into the nearest lane. And actually, this is the second lane because I don't wanna turn. I'm scanning the intersection. I see that vehicle. Intersections are the most dangerous place. I'm gonna go ahead and get over one lane to the right, one tenth lane to left, excuse me. I'm in my lane and I'm taking my time. I'm gonna make another left turn. This car's tailgating me, they're going really fast. So you can see, if you're doing everything right, cars can hit you. People are in a hurry and they're very impatient. Who am I? I'm a state certified instructor. I teach teens and adults. I've been teaching drivers here 21 years, so I'm trying to bring you value. And if this brings you value, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel once it's done. So I made my left turn, now I'm gonna make a right turn. I don't know what they're doing, so I'm gonna turn on my right turn signal. I'm scanning, I'm looking, it looks like the little dog is driving, I'm joking. So I'm turning hand over hand into the turn, and then I turn hand over hand out. Always looking, always checking, always scanning. I'm gonna make a left turn here on this street. I'm looking, I'm checking, I'm turning hand over hand into the turn, and then I turn hand over hand out. Your DMV uh, tester, your road tester will look for you to have both hands on the wheel to turn hand over hand. There's a lot of controversy about that. Um, here, in, here in North America, the overwhelming percentage, it's about 90% that turn hand over hand. Some people let the wheel spin through their hand. We're not trying to do that because you can lose control. When I teach my students, I teach them to turn hand over hand into the turn, hand over hand out. I do surveys and I'll do another survey. So I'm scanning, I'm looking around, you see people popping up everywhere. They're getting their driveway done. So these workers are working on the driveway. I'm reducing my speed. I'm staying to the right as much as possible because I don't want to hit anyone and I don't want that blood on my hands. So I'm going up slow. They're doing beautiful work. That driveway's almost done. I'm going up to the edge. See me looking, checking. I have a complete stop. You can hear all that noise. And then I turn hand over hand into the turn. And then I turn hand over hand out. I like really smooth, consistent turns. I'm gonna make a turn on this street and then I'm gonna give you a close. So I'm a state certified instructor. I teach teens and adults. If this brought you value, support me. Thank you for what you do. Bye.